Hello everyone, welcome back. It's time for more Frostpunk, chapter 1. Okay, so we are sort of okay in terms of heat for the time being. Uh, I was looking at setting up the heating hub over here just to offset the extra heating cost here, but I need those resources elsewhere for now. And the fuel stockpile will decrease for extraction stuff. So I'm really desperate for materials. Like, really desperate for materials. So we're gonna play here. We're gonna cover all of this and we will dig every single piece of this area and make it into a big sort of material location. The demand is increased, it's fine, we're still okay. And I need houses once we sort that out. So you are ready. You will be expanded in a moment. And do I have enough room for houses? If I place you there, you will need less heating. Would be really nice. Hold on. Five. I don't have enough. Wait for a second. So how far out do you go? So you go up to two boxes out in some directions. So if I say I'm gonna put another housing district here, you might be able to cut it. So I need to dig here and start getting those resources. Okay. So you're almost ready. Then we want an industrial one next to you, which will give us... We'll save a little bit of heat. even be here but this will go away i could connect those but this will go uh this will not go and you will produce the goods i need which will help with heat stuffs i do need that and it will go here so dig this stuff right here for all children no common rules steward five children are dead and dozens lay wounded after two large youth gangs met for what they call a rumble most of the children were armed with knives fighting escalated to a full-scale battle as the parents of the deceased mourn many insist these children should not have been left unattended indeed Many backstreet alleys seem to be overtaken by uncared for youth. Some areas are beginning to be dangerous even for adults. Crime is slightly increased. The persistent lack of law regulating childhood is causing crime and tension. And uh, I will fix it. Yes. In three weeks. Ooh, and I need to research heat recycling. Uh, yes, do that. Before I forget. What's happening up here? Oh, so... Are we getting the call now? I think we are. Yes. Sipping by trail to New London, 250. And you're using 10 people. I have another 20. Okay. In a cave near the bay, we found a disturbing sight. Bodies in sturdy frostland gear, neatly laid side by side and left trees, with black oil marking over their closed eyes. A ghastly burial burial ritual a map we found suggests they were heading to an old machine somewhere in the desolate coast here uh, a machine would require a source of fuel we should investigate okay so we need to check there what's this fishing village uh if i take them it's a fishing village it should give us food mm. it says people Mountains are dangerous. 
this is safe. And you have oil, prefabs, and cores. 17 weeks. You go do that. I should probably start building paths that way. Oh, wait. I know what that node is. It's what I put on the map. Yes. Uh, so, mm, I should have connected the one up here to have the access there. Okay. Now I get it. More digging. Give me a lot more materials. Extraction this well, the working long shifts because this is done. Go away. Ruby Key 27, Apothecary. Daring to dream. For years, suggesting anything against the captain and close scrutiny from stalwarts. But despite the bullshit booming from their bloody speakers, we managed to find our own way. Kept to our principles. Stayed frugal. Put families first. Watch out for our neighbors, continue our traditions. Now we have a council. Maybe it's time for us to stop dreaming and making a change. The council has inspired people to suggest new ideas about the city future. Oh, new faction. Pilgrims. Who are you guys? So, adaptation, equality, tradition. Uh, oh, you can see what they get give you with good relationships. First line teams. Uh, okay. Uh, still a small percentage. So they're breaking this down. Because we don't produce when there are no resources, and that should fix this. Which means... Extremely increased. Oh. Okay. So, since I have you here, my hitting thing is here, right? So I can dig this out. Looming call. Problem in the city. As the captain's authority weakened, different groups started pulling the city in their own direction. New London grew overpopulated. White outro and expansion attempts. Now, call is finally running out. Without heat and shelter, people will start freezing to death. Although the captain appointed you before passing, People are anxious you're not up to the task. Prove them wrong, Stuart. Cold has risen to a concerning level. People may die or suffer frostbite. Provide shelter and heat to fight it. Tension is high. People are afraid. I'm working on it, people. I am working on it. So, what is the lack of food causing? Just... This is gone, and this is ready. Housing district. Yes, so you're gonna get the heating hub. Good, good, good. And I can squeeze even another one there. That's perfect. So... Ah! Do I not need to dig those? And let's do another housing district here, here, here. No, I do need to do that. And here, and here. Okay, so that will be two of those. That will give me a little bit of housing. Uh, I heard the notification somewhere. Here. Here I... Crime in the city. The crime problem in New London continues to worsen. Scarcity of goods may drive people to acts of crime when they don't see any other way to obtain necessities. Making goods available help ensures people don't even revert to a free-for-all. If they do, watchtowers and prisons might become necessary. It's also worth examining if our law is helping us fight crime. It may be more difficult to ensure order as the population rises. If crime ramps rampart, people might be injured or killed. Tensions will grow and radicals among us will grow in popularity. But best ensure it doesn't come to this. Crime needs to go. Uh, I promised something for childhood, so I have two things. A mandatory school, faster research 
Decrease income of hit stamps? Never. Active workers increased family apprenticeship. Yes. We are definitely doing this one. And one negotiate. They want this. Have active promise against their worldview. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, well. I'm gonna see the development. Prefabs. Factory. Hmm. Oh, advanced gold blasting mine. Hold on. Do I really need that? Because coal is gonna run out. So I don't really need that. But a mechanical factory for goods, I do need it. Okay, vote. Hooray! Hear ye, hear ye. The delegates. Law takes effect. Now. Um. You're not done yet, are you? So the output is yes, yes. Ooh, this is demanding a lot of this. And you have another 78 weeks and there's still more there. Okay. How do we balance those threats? We need to start balancing these guys. Uh, notable crime, disease and cold. I'm working against both. I have 10 people who cannot do anything. Um, 46 of those only. I can do another food district. Ah. If it goes next industrial and creates disease. Okay, interesting. If it goes next to another food industry, it sort of makes a chain. So we need to start digging this way for more food. We make path to the endless stuff. And see how we go. How are we going here? This is going another 14 weeks. Did we finish starting this? We did. So it's only these people left. Oh, there's more here. What's this? Coal! Once a small port operated here to ferry materials for the generator's construction, now it's lost to the processing ice, pressing ice. Scout says they can still hear the grunts and cries of men having heavy steam cores ashore. Really? Okay, go. Um, cool. So let's let's search that then. The cold is the biggest problem. Mm -hmm. Come on, people. So we need another fifteen. So we need one more house. Um, near housing. Oh, this counts as hitting hub as well. This is lucky. Hold on. So dig this to expand. More died. So we'll take that away. You guys do not have an extended one, so you are okay. Uh, it recycling gives me a little bit more. Don't uh, shield your apprentice. Factories. So we want mechanical factory. This one. This is done. Cutthroat economy. Paid essentials. Steward. Now that we are changing. Charging for essentials, some unemployed families are unable to afford basic necessities. War goes to the worthiest. If the people were passed up, it's their own damn fault. They should put in the work instead of expecting the city to solve their problems, claimed one of Stalwart's delegate. Others are more measured and say we could provide them with a weekly allowance. If we can't offer them work, we'll give them a budget. Up to them to use it wisely. 
Now this will drop the hit. Uh, yeah, let's give them a little bit. Yeah, we only lost one hit stun. That's nothing substantial. So we need one more housing district here. And I can put even more. And I need to bring those other people. So. I need to be careful with hitting here. You have another 50. Time for a low. Uh, two weeks. Should we? So this is starting to balance out. Uh, good. So you will get the benefit of hit. No. Ah, you need to be that way. So you go there. It's the mine. Time for oh. Uh, did we not pass that? Oh, low opposed. Ooh. So they go against it because there is a lot of them. I see. I see how you're working. Cool. So now it got warmer. Good stuff. Can you undo the loss? By the looks of it, you can. And I'm gonna need more people. I don't have enough. I only have a thousand. So, housing, we are okay. Uh, did we finish that research? No. So, priority is food. Food is fixed. Excellent. Uh, you need materials, so we need more goods and more materials. What do you... you cause sickness? You go sickness, you go sickness. Okay. So, food is barely enough. Still have a bit more capacity here, so I'm not too concerned. These guys are a little happier with me. Hmm. Prefabs are running really low. I need to get those coal bits from here. So if I I cannot expand yet. Mm -hmm. Decisions, materials. So here yes, I can continue digging. So let's expand first. So if you go here, here, and here. And we are going to dig towards the endless one. Squalor is increasing. Squalor is growing. Steward, the endless cold and the wind take a heavy toll on our structures. Still grows brittle and cracks. Wood deforms and splits. Wind batters the sea. On top of this, any industry we build adds fumes and waste that accumulates if not properly dealt with. We need a steady supply of materials to maintain our infrastructure. Otherwise, the buildings will snap and the city will fall into squalor. Well, I'm working on that right now. Also, these guys are going to vote... That's that. So that's 209. I cannot expand you anymore, so you will become another district. So I need an industrial district here. Yep, 
and that's the discount you're gonna get from heating I can negotiate. Uh, only the new Londoners will negotiate. What do you want? Ventilation. Uh, or good factory. Calibrated. No, that's the other one. So I'm already researching the one against it. If I do the chemical hothouse, more food unlocks this stuff. Okay, so if I do the excessive, then it has a risk. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, let's fight it. We get it out of the way. So they didn't undo it. So chemical hothouses. So that's the bio waste ones, which are increased disease and give a lot more food. This is better. We're doing this one. Take note: a new rule enters into form. Slowly balancing the stuff. Very slowly. Hit stamps. Pilgrims suggest action. Steward. We were struggling with hit stamps. A group of pilgrims have come forward with an idea on how to solve it. We should pass durable goods. Let us pursue it and the city will benefit. The pilgrim looks with distrust at what our communities propose. They would surely appreciate you getting behind their idea. Hmm. You're only 5%. I will put piss off the rest of the city. They are neutral, so they can deal with it. So, you're ready. Uh, we have the mechanical factory. 180. So, you're gonna go in this industrial one. And you're gonna make this. And we need even more materials. And do we have anything for the extraction, guys? No. That should be the next thing we research, but until then... Another extraction district. So you will do that. And build this. District employment... How many people? Because I don't have enough? Yeah, I'm very low on people. Ah! Scouts are done. Well, they will have to bring the rest in. What's happening here? Old cistern. Nothing I can do for that. I can salvage more cores and send five people here. Or we found oil. A ruined machine lies across a crevice. Wagons spilled in there by snow. There are clear signs that people have come and gone from this side, even storing goods here. But what amazes our scouts is most, the most is the huge quantity of readily available oil. Okay, let's do that. Ah, is so the map we were playing on the prologue? Okay. Oil tombs. No, that's... On the broken shore lies an old Deleric Dread. It seems to have been upgraded to run on oil, as it rests beside rich deposits. Perhaps the site was a refueling station, but deep in the black pools lie rows of frozen bodies, wrapped in shrouds and placed in the steel wells. Our scouts shudder at the sight. These oil deposits would surely solve our fuel needs, but we will have to desecrate these graves to access them all. Remove the bodies, more deposits, or respect the dead. We'll only access the vacant oil deposits. Uh... Hmm. Well, we need what we need, so remove the bodies. 
Oil will save the city, but we need to adapt our generator to use it. In the meantime, we'll need to establish a reliable supply. It's time we settle beyond New London. Create a colony at the old dreadnought and connect it with a solid trail to New London. Only then we can sup only then supply can be assured. Okay. So we need a path and we need colonists. I doubt. I have the stuff for that. Send these guys to collect that. Oh, and we are here. An old coal hauling crawler, half buried in the snow. It appears the transport's navigating device were tampered with, and its charts were inaccurate. Graffiti has been etched into one side. New London litches. Uh, 50,000 coal stockpile. Is it stockpile? Will I be able to use it? Well, let's take it. And then, ooh, we can have another outpost here. Okay. Well, man. Multiple pods of whales rose here after being pursued by humanity's last whaling vessel into the freezing harbor. The scouts are amazed at the sight of the massive bodies made pale by the ice. Finally, I found my white whale. Oh, you found... What was the name of the white whale? Moby Dick? The scout commander jokes, no one left. Years ago, the captain sent a team with the machines to bore through the ice and mine out the whalemen. We can make the machines back to New London to assist our extraction, or send a new team here to finish the job. Um, and production efficiency. No, 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 no. Outpost. So, an outpost here could increase our supply by 100 food until 100,000 is depleted. Deplete. That's fine. We need to connect that. And there is an expedition to the frozen sea. Partially frozen water as far as the eye can see. Some people tried to cross it on foot years ago to search for the fable promised land. Yeah. Uh -huh. uh, possible finds food and people. Frozen ocean. We are not going there. Graveyard. Materials and coal. Probably due to an unknown sea current. This area is full of shipwrecks, ground into mangled remains by tons of sea ice. It is a dangerous place where a few could dare to threat. Safe. Okay, well, you guys can explore that, and you guys are going to explore that later. I'm hauling. That's another dangerous one. Okay. I want to balance this city before I start building the other outpost. Um. How do? So I'm making this. Raise the speed a little bit. I have time. 125 weeks, so that's something. Remember to keep your heat lamp maintained. Uh -huh. It might just save your life. I'm pretty sure they know that by now, but you know, just see. Oop. Uh yeah, so now I have a hundred thousand, so I'm not... Am I consuming it now, or are they stopped? So you have... Oh no, it's going down and I'm just losing it. Ooh, that's not good. Well done. So I am actually wasting it. Uh, 1550, that's what we want. And we want it close to an extraction district. So these are all extraction districts. So that should save some workers here. Yeah, take it. Close. Uh, it's okay there. Chua Miller, apprentice. Spinning dog hair into yarn. Ouch, my finger. This effing spin spindles. Mr. Boss Lady keeps joking, I'll fall asleep and get woken up by a prince. I don't get it. If a prince came near me, I'd rob him blind, then make him do the bloody spinning. <laughs> but it's alright. Gonna beat my record today. Nice strong yarn. Auntie Mabel says, if I can weave, I can work with her at the mill. Beats freezing in the streets. Yep. Family apprenticeship promises a better future for the children of the city. Good. So the main issue at the moment is squalor. Everything else is fine. Good. Law. 
what am I gonna pass? Uh, food, goods, uh, city. We don't need anything for contagion yet. This is community stuff. Yeah, I see hit stamps. Everyone must volunteer their times. Yes. Negotiate. So, 11. So, the pilgrims and the stalwarts are against it. The first landers are open and the Londoners are not. So, the Londoners are my friends. Uh, chemical hothouse. Build one. Well, I'm going to build one anyway. So, that's fine. Easy enough. Because I'm researching it. The moment it's done, I'm going to build it. So, that works. Here you. Hear ye. The delegates have spoken. The law takes effect. Ah, and they just finished research. So. Oh, shit. Storage. Storage is exactly at 100, so I need another storage. Um. <laughs> also, how are we going on food? Not enough. Are we going on goods? We're so more of this. So this is meant to be 50 and 50. So that's just for coal. While this... Okay, so this is for both. Um, that's the only other one I can have. But then I'll need to tear it down. That will be a bit of a waste if I do that. Hmm. Do those stack? Do those give 10 and 10? So I'm going to put it in the middle and then see if it gives the bonus to both. I don't think it will. Uh... That's plus 60. Let's see if it goes up to 120. Actually, it works. Okay. Intriguing. Research. Uh, what do we need? Everything. <laughs> also, we need to do something about... Um, contacts. We definitely need that. Uh, fracturing pump jacks. Squalor increase 60 materials, 20 materials, disease increased. Mm. No, let's do this. Okay, so our population is rising steadily, which is not necessarily ideal. I can bring more people in. This is running out. Which is definitely not ideal. Let's uh, bring those guys. Okay, so you have a hundred food. Until it's depleted. Okay, good, good, good. Do you need a road? Send it? No, they just go back and forth. Okay. Uh, okay, okay, that's fine. And I want to go that way now, right? Yes. Start making this path. Hold on, guys, hold on. I know I'm popular, but... Deposits run low. Coal is running out. Some of the coal deposits in this will also run out. They can use explosives to access deeper veins of coal. Hmm. The Frostlanders say we should send children for missed ore in the tighter tunnel. Some did this as kids themselves and they survived and escaped. Uh, mm. All deposits increased by 10 or 15%. Mostly from the Frostlander families. This will balance it for the rest. Okay. We can send the children. No boom. Mm. Yeah. So 
We need more materials. Not enough hit stamps. We're up to 22, which is pretty decent. Um, I really need to make the colony. Time is running out. Food is okay because we're getting it from the fishing village. Heat is okay. Let's do the thing, spawn this. So that will increase it here. And now that is break. I should have dug that little bit there. I always do this. I always forget like one piece. And now we need more housing. Um... Oh, prefabs. Yeah, that's a thing. Well. I'll risk this just to get some prefabs. You are full. Uh, food, chemical hothouse. Yes, I need to remember to build that. 80 stamps and 40 of this. Yes, that's okay. So by the time you are ready, fire in the sap. Of course, it's going to catch fire. Uh, some of the shields in case the rescue. Fire has broken out in the in our coal mine. If we don't react, we'll lose the mine along with the deposit. Some of the stalwarts engaged in the rescue effort insist we can still save the mine by cutting off the earth supply to the shaft and suffocating the flames. That will kill people. But some of the child miners are still making their way out. It will suffocate them too. Nope. Uh the cell will be set there, will be destroyed, and the district remain called reduced by 50%. Mm. Yeah, do it. So... There is no coal, so... They are demolishing that, and then we will demolish this. This speeds up the inevitable problem. So I still have those two to drain. You are here. It's kind of silly that you cannot build the building from here. Chemical hothouse. Go to the infinite one. Neutral supporting. What do you guys give me? Nothing. Why do you give me nothing? So we're gonna need prefab for the road, right? Five per route segment. So and then. Build that, because we'll need to reach that. Uh, and that will be a few more. We got the heat, so... Management, that's fine. Uh, new low. What are we gonna put? Hmm... I wonder how you unlock the rest one. Generals family. Uh, this will de stop decreasing trust. Uh, 
The disease will be harvested and there are healthy body parts used to support city healthcare. That's useful. I don't want anything from the rule side things things yet. Uh, disease is minor. Everything is minor at the, the moment. Will announce the name of this month's top worker and tonight's master. Population is a problem. So, maybe. Those rule ones are necessary. Uh, those are abilities. Hmm. This is where I choose what happens. Okay. Now I'll wait. Now, let me see what you can show. So we need more goods. And if I do that, it increases the total output by a lot, but makes things a lot more unhealthy. Okay. So. Lucifer were minor. I'm tired of people treating me like a baby. I knew it was risky working in the mines, but I chose it because grandma froze to death, my mom froze to death, and my brother lost his hands. So if I died in the hole, stoking the fire, if I saved one family from seeing the eyes on their mom's face, then it'd be worth it, see? But no one asked me. They let the corn bear, and now it's getting proper cold again. This will need even more fuel when the temperature drops. Yeah, they will. Um, let's connect. Why can I not? Oh. That's right. So that will connect them. Uh, you need a trail. So, I don't have people, so, nope. Uh, excavation district, bye-bye. Yes. So that will fix that, but not the goods. I can overtime them to capture the goods. That's fine should be enough and now I need another housing district all those things additive I wonder so you go here here and here I'm happy to get some of the squalor that not that's not going to stay because I need to get that call too. How am I gonna get that call? Um, panel, you are in the way. Thank you. Is there any anything for houses? So those are the pump decks. I got those. Um. Maintenance, war compensation, housing block. There you are. Subsidized housing. I will lose one hit. Uh, this will give me 20. So what are you? Are you a building? Okay, so you can build this. Ah, okay. So for the people that work in those districts or... There is regular housing, which is 10 and 20. With no negative. There is dense housing, which holds 25, so which is almost double. And decrease, uh, slightly increase disease. I think we're going to go with the dense housing. Who supports this? These guys only? So most want the housing block. That's just 10. That's not enough. Oh, wait, it's plus 10. And it's a building slot. No, that's okay. That's that's reasonable. That's very reasonable, actually. Fifteen people. 
Uh, what do you need? A hundred prefab, which I have. Twenty frosted teams, and a core. Uh, where are my other? Oh, they are here. Well, I can stop them from here. That will give me twenty. Send the colonists here to build this. They will sell it here in 15 weeks. Okay, good. Uh, Imperial Freighter. The wreck of a mighty freighter marked with the colors of the old empire. It is the only wreck we see facing away from and not towards the coast. It seems to have collided with another vessel and partially sunk. But fortunately enough remains above the surface to be salvaged. 2.4 million materials. Ooh. Okay, good to know. Uh, Royal Navy. We located a wrecked ship floats on its side, encased in a massive block of ice. HMS Atalanta. Barely legible on the aft starboard hull. We were unable to get inside, but we found a jagged hole into the engine room. It was full of coal and not much else. The place made our scouts quite uneasy. We noticed that our compasses were behaving erratically in the vicinity of the wreck. Probably best not to linger here. Hmm. Okay, so that's more areas, but they are all dangerous than deadly. And the med the meadows are deadly? Okay. Well. I wonder if this all continues. Wait, there's something right here. I wonder if all of this continues on the next chapter, or is the chapter that big? Which will be interesting if that's the case. Okay, so, need a few more houses which are being built here. Uh, someone died from emergency. I. Yeah. No emergency shifts, but we are going to expand this. So, dig. Uh, yeah, it should make some more. So, all is going down rapidly. A cold spell will soon hit us. Prepare. It just hit us, not soon. <laughs> uh, but that means I can start recycling and rebuilding some stuff. Mm. So, now that you will be upgraded, so let's go here. An automaton has broken down and is blocking traffic. Technicians are on their Where way. Where is it? Where is the automaton? You promised me an automaton. Now I have a lot of hit stamps but I don't have anything to do do so uh, switch you to this because every time you expand it this problem happens and that's the pump jack and that's the housing oh the factory I never made the factory uh, place you place you here Abbe Chambers, 90, foreman Cypress, longing to join his wife in the beam. 90 years old, 90 summers, well, winters, more like. I've had a good life, I guess. Well, I had a life anyway. Not everyone in the old Queen Heath crew can say the same. I'd always thought it, I'd be, I always thought I'd be sharing my lady's grave, but now Pete's pressuring me to donate my body to the city. Apparently, them doctors are using dead fox skin to fix up frostbite or something. Can they leave me alone? Haven't I been through enough? Ooh. The lack of law regulating funerals is causing tension to rise through the city. Let's fix that straight away. Um, <laughs> People are divided, but they are not really... Yeah, we're gonna go with the harvesting ones. 
I can... I want to get the cross guys to my thingy. Let's continue with the Londoners. What do you want? Um, that's a no. And what do you guys want? Hydraulic. So you want the other pump jack, you want coal mine, and you want composite factory. Uh, well, you want me to research it. Can I research both? Uh, where are you? So that's a factory and that's a composite factory. So that's a different thing. Recast than synthetic. Recast is the cheap one. You use oil and you create materials. Okay. And you need less oil. Hmm. So recast composite factory wouldn't be a bad option. Um, so if we go here and we go with this, negotiate with the first lander, and you have the recast. Okay, you got a deal. I wonder if you can pass things at 100%. That'd be interesting. Okay, so let's get you that. Recast, yes. How are things here? Uh, 15 weeks. Still work in progress. A little bit of... Uh, a negative on materials, but that's okay. All is what I'm really worried about. Until the other thing is up and running. So we have a little bit of coal here and we have more coal here. Uh, extraction, you need prefab. Up. Oh, all deposit discovered. Where? Oh, what? Uh, to open city colony summary. Okay, you can see what's going on with this. Go to this location, send people, or send resources. Huh. Oh, I'm actually building it. Okay, okay. Uh, are you the same as before? Do you have the seals? No, you don't. So... How am I going to organize you? I'm going to need the prefabs. 100%. You only have 180. We want the oil. You have a lot of oil. More. So effectively, we want to tackle all of these. Keep things. Keep them going. Can I transfer food here so I don't need to build food locally? Okay, let's try this. Dig. Um... So, we want to dig this. Oh, and you will need houses, of course. So, dig this. Build an extraction. Your prefer will be the primary. Yeah, that's 150. So, if I put you here, I won't be able to get the rest. So. Ah, I need to dig this. Let's wait for a sec. Because there is no point not getting this. Extraction. So, near generator. Can I not build here? Yeah, I can. Uh, oh, is it because... 
Is it just for housing? Oh no, I cannot start them. Okay, that's why. I'm silly. So you go there. So that is done. Now another extraction will go this way to decrease the heat needed. Yes. Visions of our future. Diverging ideas. Uh, everyone in New London is awaiting the moment we get a steady supply of oil. So many fears would vanish. So many dreams made possible. But those dreams seem to be diverging. Stalwarts paint visions of an eternally warm New London. As warm as only the eldest among us remember. Pilgrims want to use this newfound power to reach out and settle remote places on the frostland, making it its own. Make it our own. Both factions started thinking on how to use oil when it reaches New London. When it does, we'll have to decide. Okay. That's expected somewhat. Uh, I have three weeks of coal. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that is not enough. Not even remote. The excess food. How do we send stuff? So, here, eh, resource transfer. So, I want to send food. Wait, they have food? So, that means that they are all dreadnought. This is okay. They have no heat, but this has heat. We have extra goods which we can give them. Is that a one-time thing or a permanent thing? I think that's a permanent thing. Yeah, it's a permanent thing. Okay. That's, that's a good economy. So you're taking care of that. Um, I'm going to need materials which do not exist here, right? Yes. So, generator turn on. And I have 16 extra. So, I need to give that 16. Oh, there is a stockpile. Yep, you can take all the stockpile. And that's 16. So, that will keep you running for now. So, you don't freeze to death. Uh, so I need to bring materials on this side. So, New London. So you're bringing 250, you're stockpiling 570 a day. Uh... Do I have it or do I not have it yet? No, it doesn't look like I have it, right? Because if I have 820 of these... Yeah, I don't think I have it yet. I think it takes time to transfer. Okay, so let's get some more materials. Uh, so have more coal. Let's get the coal from here. And we'll be digging these. Unwanted destiny. Family apprenticeship. Stuart, a father has come to our offices with his son. They both ask that you hear them out. This boy is not cut for a blacksmith, said the father. His knack is for words. Poetry, 
I can burn steel, but he can steer souls. Please let him be apprenticed under someone who can teach him to use his talents. Her plea echoes the sentiment of that family apprenticeship limits the prospect of children born into arduous career paths. Make the law more flexible. Uh, children who find a willing mentor shouldn't be forced to be apprenticed to their family. Family apprenticeship is less effective. Relationships increase with stewards. Yeah, it's alright. I'll just lose some workforce, which... Uh, that's a problem. <laughs> Oops. Uh, hello, guys. Get those. I want them all. I do need them all. Operations scout headquarters building. There's no point in taking the soil until we learn how to use it. Do we not know how to use it? Do we need to research something? Um okay. Is there something else to scout? I think there was something yeah, the frozen sea. So expedition there. You're giving me a little bit of oil. But it's not enough to offset this. So, back here. Need more oil. Like, urgent. How am I going to get that when you don't even have any prefab? When you don't have any houses? The heating here is exactly breaking even. Uh, I do need those 50 prefabs. Can I make another one? No. You are collecting stuff. So is this separate to the other one? So if I use this here. Okay. The two settlements are different. That's good to know. Uh, do we have any other laws to pass? Nope. They are all locked. So, I should probably start digging towards these and make my way back there and then give me an extraction thing over here I cannot connect them this way but I can connect those and then people, people are the problem Oh wait, I can build... I don't need an, a district here. Hold on. You can go there. Uh, I will need to go down that path out of this path. You do this. I can build those houses, right? Housing block. You will give me 10 soldiers, so I can have one and one on these. But I'll take those down, but I won't take down... Oh wait, extraction. Yeah, I need the pump, right? Yeah, because this will produce more oil. So, 300 workers. That's fine, we should have that. Let's quickly check New London so we don't die. Do not be alarmed by any unusual noises coming from the generator. Pumping fits, heat recycling. Stewards, we notice a rise in chronic lung conditions after we started pumping recycled heat into our housing districts. Okay. Uh, doctors suspect fumes from the industrial plants where the heat originates leaked into people's homes. 
If this goes on, it can lead to bronchitis and even death, especially among the weakened and elderly, said one physician. We could install filters to block the fumes, but would this would reduce the amount of heat we recycle. That's okay. Use the filter. Yes. That is a very easy choice. So we have 250 people here. Uh, give me... Go to 80%. And you go right there. Uh, also materials. I will meet the demand. And then I'll balance it to the other side. Yes. So this will remain... This is done, so you go away. All of these have scaled down because we don't have a lot of people. So we need more materials. How am I gonna get you more materials? Building, 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 industrial. You create prefects and goods. You pre provide materials, but you need oil, which I don't have yet. Also, you're incredibly expensive. I make another district here. So you produce 190. If we make one more extraction district here. Let's dig. I'm doing the same thing again. Dig, 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 dig. Dig, dig. Dig. And then dig the rest. Do not waste time on repairs. A new model is safer than a repurposed one. That's debatable. So. What's happening here? Is the pump ready? The pump is ready. We can transfer a good amount now. So you can take all of it. We don't need to expand on this side for now. So you are fine. A new fuel flows. Anticipation fills the air as the first transport of oil is sent to New London. The dream of a future without filling coal feels surreal. To make it happen, however, we will need to modify the generator to turn this black gold into heat. Ah! This will be irreversible. What future we build for ourselves will depend on it. Oh. Excellent time. Completed chapter one. Perfect time to wrap up this episode. Ambitions. Chapter two. People tear as oil reaches the sea, but the question of what it means for our future remains. The years of suffering are coming to an end. Let us improve the generator farther. And build and pump oil into the snow of the city mill forever. So the stalwart leaders. However, the pilgrims disagree. What stewards want is hubris. New London won't last forever. The frost is our reality. But we have to embrace it. Venture forth, use oil to settle new homes in the wide beyond. The people look at you to decide the city's future. We will defeat the frost. Or we will be, or we will embrace the force. Let me know in the comments down below. What did you choose?